It's a lot easier to cut plastic than it is to cut concrete. We are ready to assemble the Wall Drain Pro. The first thing you need to do is cut a small collar so it can insert into the T. That way, if you have a larger, if you have a larger block, you can cut this collar to whatever length you need it. So let's just go ahead and put this in. You can see how easy that is. Then we will insert it into the T. And that's a simple snap fitting also. And then to actually insert the four inch tile onto the T, as shown. You can see the installation. This is too tall for this block. And we took a few minutes earlier and cut the grate to a shorter size. I'll go ahead and put that in. You can see how nice that fits. And then the nice thing about this installation, you can see where this drain tile is. Here's where you would start filling in gravel behind the wall for your drainage. That will take the water, get it into the tile, and move it away from the wall so you don't have hydraulic pressure to turn your wall and push it over. This is the last piece that we'll put into place. You can see how nice and easy and how neat and beautiful Wall Drain Pro is in a retaining wall.